Hello indie game lovers, it's Slushy here. Today I want to show you guys Talbot's Odyssey. That's by Mini Boss Studios. Um, they're not a full-time game developing company. They're just like a bunch of talented friends who collaborate on little game jams and stuff. They have a bunch of cool games to check out on their website. I'll put a link to that in the description. Now the main reason I want to show you guys this game, uh, apart from it being underrated, underexposed and all that, I'm hoping some of you guys will go check out their website and play some of their other previous games. Um, I think once you've done that, you're going to be pretty excited for Out There Somewhere. I'll put a link to the trailer for Out There Somewhere in my um, description. I've pre-ordered it and I'm, yeah, I'm pretty keen to play it. I'll be putting out a video on that in the next couple of days. So the storyline in this is that you're like a little henchman for this evil I don't know what he is, like a troll type thing. He's some sort of overlord. And um, he's assigned you to go find ingredients for his stew, which sounds kind of silly, but it plays really well. It has like a lot of unique little elements, and the animation's really good. So I hope that after um, Out There Somewhere comes out, that they go back to work on this. And hopefully Out There Somewhere sells enough copies that they can give up their day jobs. And, make games full time because the world needs more indie game developers and less people with regular day jobs. I'm not going to show you guys too much of this game because it's not very long. It's only in beta and yeah it's not finished. But what they have done is definitely good. As you can see he's got little chubby wings and they help him fly and he also emits light so you've got to use that ability to find secret passages and stuff I'm only up to about level 2 or maybe 3 but at the risk of sounding like a fanboy I've been really impressed at the art the whole time and the music as well is really good I thought so I'm just going to do a little bit more here I'll try and maybe clear the first sort of tutorial area and yeah, then I'll leave it there no more spoilers kind of thing uh, also, I've, um, I'm playing this with my PlayStation 3 controller using Joy to Key. So I'll put a link to, I'll upload a profile for that. And it may not be there instantly, maybe the, a few hours after I upload, maybe the next day. Because it's kind of late at the moment. And I'll probably be going to bed as soon as I press upload. Probably won't even have a proper description, but um, yeah, I'll put eventually put a Joy to Key link in there for a profile. So it controls really nicely with the controller. I I much preferred it than the keyboard. There's nothing wrong with the keyboard controls, but for a platformer, I just really like having a controller and sitting back in my chair, I'm nice and comfortable. Actually, when I play games, I kind of look like that fat Overlord does. Just sit back with my gut hanging out like that. Not really, anyway. So if I had one criticism of this game, it's that, and it may just be me, but I couldn't find a way to um, make it full screen. So it's 640 by 480, which was really small, on because I use 1080p. Um, I had to change my desktop resolution to 640 by 480, because I wanted to see this artwork in more detail. Cause it's quite, I reckon it's really good. So as you can see, these night statue things, they, um, when you hit them, they light up your room for a second, and I guess you meant to use that to t uh, to find secret passages and stuff. It slowly introduces more and more sort of puzzle elements. If you like platform games, you're definitely going to like it. So I'm um, head to the link in the description. Also, I'll put the official trailer for Out There Somewhere in the description, and I'm pretty tired, so I'm going to head off. I hope this was enough to get you guys interested because this game definitely deserves some attention. Have fun guys, enjoy your gaming, I'll catch you later. Holy crap, this looks hard. Ooh.